So let me show you uh, how to possibly route the the core lock cable on the uh, Honda Rebel 1100. So I I install a core lock here on my handlebar. You can see. Uh, so this is the wireless charger. This is the anti uh vibration thing. And this is just the, the handlebar mount. So this is the 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 core lock cable. Um I went with this core lock cable because they have that uh water stripper thing built in. I could have bought a USB C to C because the you know the rebel the Rebel takes uh, USB 8, but I want to use that core cable. Um, so to make it work, I, I actually just bought a, a, a USB uh, A to C. Uh, this, is a, this is just an Amazon brand, USB A to C adapter. So that, that should work. Anyway, um, so this is how I, I route the cable. So you can see, uh, just cable comes from here all the way, and you can kind of like follow, follow, follow along this cable as well. See, and this is there's a there's a really handy uh, hand, hanger here, so you can just hang the the cable there, and then move along. So um, you will see things pretty clearly after you take out the uh, the the cover. So there are three covers, just a plastic cover like this, and it's just a single screw. Um, so you can take take out this one. Um, take out take out this one. I want this one. And then take out this one to make to see things a little bit easier. So this one, I assume you know how to how to uh, take out the battery cover there. So just one screw there. But yeah, uh, for this to take out this one, uh, it's a little bit tricky because you have to uh, pull downward and then pull out because you can see you can kind of see the there's a locking mechanism there. So there's there's a hook here. Oh, where you can see it. So there's a hook. So it, it's actually hooked into this. You have so that's why you have to pull down and pull. But after you take out all those three uh, covers, and it's you 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 should be pretty easy to see how the cable should go. So I just I just route it here. So go through it here. Go come here all the way. And go here. Uh probably here you, you can use the zip lock to to tighten the cable a little bit better. I'm gonna do it after. Um so and then after you take out this cover, you can pretty easy to see there are so there are many gaps you can you can put the cable through. So this is the ca the coil cable, and it's just so easy to go through it here. And then there you go. So you just put it in. I picked the longer cable just in case, cause I um I think the um the, the other cable with a ninety degree angle it's a little bit shorter. That might work as well, but I, I just picked this longer cable just in case. But uh hope hope this helped. Thank you.